The only thing that's left now is the feet. What I did for those is to use my brown mix to indicate lines that follow the contours of his feet first and then follow that up with softened shadow areas that will merge the lines into the shadows. As far as the little lines that are affecting the contours on his fingers, if you've ever drawn Spider-Man's hands, then you'll understand that the feet of this parrot are much the same process. I did the little claws with more brown and left a little highlight on each one. He's actually got a fourth finger that's not visible here because he's a zygodactyl like others in the parrot family. So that last finger would be on the back side of the ring that he's perched on, and we can't see it, but it's definitely there.